Hello everyone, uh, welcome to this Cypress tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn about the find command in Cypress. So let's begin. If you want to find the descendant DOM elements of any locator, then you should use the find command. Now what this descendant DOM elements of the selector means. So here, let me explain you. Assume that you have a parent tag, parent tag here in HTML and it contains multiple child elements okay uh, let me copy this one from here so that we can quickly do it here so child one child two then child three so this parent html tag actually contains now the three child right and this parent will be closed here Okay, so this is a scenario and now you want to locate or find this child too, for example. So with the help of this parent, you can go to this child DOM element. And if we talk about the real time example, so let me copy this whole one here and paste it here. So in HTML, you must have heard about UL, then under the UL, we have different ally right so let me copy this one paste it here paste it here and let me copy this one and paste it here so under this ally so we need to find this particular ally which is a dom element which is a descendant of this ul element so we can first get this ul and through this one we will go to the child tom element and in order to go to the child we need to use the find command and here in cypress this find command works sim in, a, in a similar way in a similar way just like it works in jquery jquery dot find method the second point here we need to know is that this find command needs to be changed and here we need to change it with the get command so this means that what we need to do is that first we need to find like cy dot and we need to find the ul here and through the ul then we need to use this find and inside the find we need to go with the ally and also we can use the dot contains here and we can also use dot css in order to match the particular ally here right and if we talk about find here in in with respect to the command called contains so contains always used for the text but here find will be used for the dom element here only so let me add one point more here find command will be for dom element only now this is a scenario which we need to understand and this is all about the find command now we will go to the our vg studio code and we will now use this command in order to learn it practically so let me go to the vg studio code here and I will be using the same code which we used earlier so that we can continue from there. I am going here and creating a new file called third.js and inside the third.js I will be copying all my code and paste it here. So before we proceed what we need to do is that let's open the Cypress runner and execute this code and see what happens 
Now the Cypress test runner is up and running. Now execute this test and see either it's working fine or not. Click on this one. It will open the browser. Go to Orange HRM demo website and it will log in into the application and see either it works or not. So this is redirecting here somewhere, but no worries. It's working and yes. And now we are on the leave list page. So the script is working fine now. Now what we need to do, we need to use the find command here. And let me go to the main website and now try to inspect the HTML here and see. So we need to go to this leave section here and under the leave section, we need to go to this leave list, right? So this is a leave list page. And here, if we talk about this more menu, so if I inspect this one, so let me inspect this one and you will see that. So this is a UL here, right? And under this UL, we have this allies, right? And under the ally, we have a anchor tag. So for example, if I want to access this element using the UL. So what I need to do is that first I need to get the locator of this one and then using the find I will go to this particular ally which I want. So let's go to Visual Studio Code here and let me open the Cypress runner here and now inspect here and see Yes, this is the UL and this is the get command. Copy this one from here and now go here and paste this command here. And now we will be using the find command here. And inside the find, what we need to find exactly. So we need to find, assume that we need to click on this apply button. Okay. And if I go here, so this is under the UL, then we have ally and under the ally there's anchor tag. So here it is located, right? Now we need to go here and we need to provide ally space A and then once it will find what it will do. So till here, what we did is that we are saying the Cypress that Cypress go to this UL and find ally and having the anchor tag. Okay. But the problem here is that if I go here, almost every ally has an anchor tag. So which exactly anchor tag we need to use, right? And in our case, assume that we are going with the apply. So how we can do that? Just go here. Then take a benefit of contains command and here in contains use as we know that contains search for the particular text and after that once it will find you should click on this one right now save this one and let's execute this one and see what happens so it will go there go to the leaf page now so it clicked on the apply and now we are on the apply leaf page so that's how you should use the find command thank you so much for watching this tutorial if you like our content then do like comment share and subscribe our channel once again thank you so much and see you in the next tutorial